Attention everyone, watch or skip to the end of this video to find out who gets drafted into Tournament 4. Alright guys, we are going to start off this very special video with Channel 96 News, September 2020 edition. Everything you need to know that's been going on in Season 9 until now. Everything that's been happening. All right, let's go. First things first, Taylor Swift, not to play to hardship, but trying to handicap what records might win Grammy no nominations is unlike the guesswork of any other top entertainment awards show. Also on the list is Kim Kardashian, whose Chrissy Tangan and John Legend received a barrage of support from famous friends, including Kim Kardashian and Gabriel Union following the model's heartbreaking message announcing the pregnancy loss this was literally just on the news on television actually like literally not even two hours ago at least in my area i don't know about your area next up the world cup um gernot rohar took charge of nigeria after they failed to qualify for the 2017 afcon Football, U.S. soccer team San Diego Loyal walked off the pitch during its match against Phoenix Rising on Wednesday in reaction to an alleged homophobic slur towards one of its players. Which, that sounds very, very bad. We should have peace with everybody and not just do everything bad. Alright, next up, American football, Matt Rolholy and Kilf Kingsbury are set to match coaching strategies again, only this time at the NFL level when the Carolina Panthers host the Arizona Cardinals on Sunday. And bonus footage, not, well, bonus on American football that I'm just going to talk about is, if you haven't known already, the Steelers and the Titans game has been postponed due to COVID-19. Yep, it is the first game ever to be postponed from the virus and guess who's to blame the titans as they have at least 11 positive cases on their entire team now if i were me why don't you consider covid a type of injury and just have those players sit out or but what i mean by sit out is not even allow them in the building because of covid because literally that's but if it's got a majority of the um, coaches and stuff, then it's a problem. So that's probably what happened. So Next up, Fortnite. Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 4 ends on November 30th, 2020. Which is in the middle of Season... What I originally was going to call it was Season XI, but I changed my mind. That next season is going to be called Season Y. Which pretty much gives you a guess on what Season of the last month will be season Z yeah I'm trying to make everything a little different so that it's pretty cool foe appearances can be deceiving as you approach faux noodles a Vietnamese restaurant that's been open since 2018 ramen at noon on Tuesday the parking lot at the home video library in Cantel is completely full not for electronics but rather for the red food cart parked outside as you can see in the picture, it's ramen noodles. Soba, Japan is a country that fully embraces the challenge changing of the seasons, and this is most apparent when you look at the menus in the restaurant, which is also including soba. Cupcakes, Halloween treats have arrived at Disney's Yacht and Beach Club, and they are both spooky and delicious. They look pretty delicious to me too. Weather. As Americans hunker down to weather the pandemic this winter at home, nearly every facet of life will remain unended to safeguard against the coronavirus. And also, if you look on the right, it looks like it's going to be very, very cold around Maine, Massachusetts, and New York. It's going to be very wet in Washington, Idaho, and Northern California, and some of Nevada. And maybe even western Montana and a lot of Canada. But then on the um, so southern regions in the southeast, 
it is very dry and mild, which is what's causing all the wildfires right now. Which is pretty dangerous. It's been... Our country is pretty much turning into what Australia was going through during January. Yeah, pretty terrible. I feel glad that I live in the East Coast. Well, Northern East Coast. Because if I did not... I would be in trouble. All right, next topic, coronavirus. Coronavirus vaccine trial participants report day-long exhaustion, headaches, and fever, but some say it's worth it. In my opinion, I'm not trying to be biased or anything, but I think it's worth it as well. Unless it gives you major symptoms that could change your life forever that are negative. That's the only exception. All right, next topic, the news in general. The news about the news. Google will pay publishers more than $1 billion over the next three years through a new program for leasing news. Music. Months after its fit initial release, Billie Eilish finally dropped the music videos for her James Bond theme, No Time to Die, on Thursday, October 1st. Sports. Sports team owners listen to players but support Republicans to the tune of millions of dollars. Yeah, you kind of see how that's going, which means a bunch of team. You'll probably see most of the um, sports teams as Republicans, as that's what that's saying. I'm an independent, so. I don't route for either of the two, because I know both of them have done terrible things in the past several months. So, Unemployment. American, American employers continue to cut jobs, signaling new anxiety about the course of the coronavirus pandemic and uncertainty about further legislative relief. Fudge. Legislative release. No, relief. What am I doing? Man, I'm the worst anchor ever. Crime. A Los Angeles County District Attorney candidate Turner as San Francisco's chief prosecutor has come under renewed security. I can never seen that word before. For pol oh my gosh, policies that many say resulted in surging crime rates. I am a terrible anchor. I'm sorry. As you can see, most of these have, all these have quotes, so therefore they have came from different websites. Supreme Court. President Trump's selection of Judge Amy Corey Barrett as his nominee to fill the Supreme Court seat left vacant by the death of Ruth Barter Glimsburg came just 38 days before the presidential election on November 3rd. We will cover more at the start of the next season. Well, we'll cover more news. Most of it's probably going to be politics. It's going to be like, because the next news update comes out on November 1st after this one. Healthcare. Fox News host Chris Wallace questions President Tr Donald Trump and former Vice President Joe Biden on healthcare during the first presidential debate of the 2020 election. Check out CNN Facts first on their website. I, didn't, I forgot to remove that one. I forgot to remove that. My bad. Race. California Governor Gavin Newsom signed a law requiring publicly traded corporations headquartered in California to appoint directors from un underrepresented communities to their boards. The first law in the country to dedicate the racial makeup of corporate boards. Donald Trump, the Agriculture Department last week began mandating that millions of boxes of surplus food for needy families include a letter from President Donald Trump claiming credit for the program. Mike Pence, Vice President Mike Pence takes center stage next week when he debates Senator Kamala Harris for the only time in the campaign. Joe Biden, an eternity representing alleged Keynote shooter Kyle Richard Horse has announced plans to sue 
Democratic presidential nominee Joe Biden and his campaign for liberal on his client's behalf after Biden shared a video that appears to suggest that teenager is a white supremacist. Kamala Harris. I could not find an image for this one, but shortly after Sen Kamala D. Harris became Joe Biden's running mate, the Democratic national community began receiving thousands of donations in the precise amount of 19.08, aka 19.08, without any obvious explanation. And that is the end of your local news, and it's time for us to go over the coronavirus. Welcome back. They did it. It's their big day. Or is it? As according to this notice, the following countries of this list has zero active cases of COVID-19. And the reason why I say, or is it, is because this month there are even less than last time. As there are now only 11 people, nope, 11 countries that have zero cases. Which is lower than last time. Which I'm getting more and more disappointed because there was originally 25 a while back. Now there's only 11. But number 11 is St. Vincent Grenadines. I don't know if I pronounced that right. But their 11th. 10th place goes to Marcao. 9th, Timur Leste. 8th, St. Lucia. 7th, New Caledonia. 6th, Grenada. 5th, Greenland. 4th, Falkland Islands. 3rd, Montserrazate. 2nd, Vatican City. And 1st, Angolia. Angolia has been number 1 for more than one month. Because they have... Not only does all these have zero cases, active cases, I'm also sorting them by total cases. The one who's number one has the least total cases in history, as that's why they're number one. Alright, and that's all for this list, and now it's time to go over the special events that's going to be happening during Season X. Welcome to Season X, an all new season on Huge Own 1, where new beginnings happen. Let's see what we can possibly encounter. Well, on... October 6th, Tournament 3 will go from the top 9 to the top 6, as Round 9 is expected to begin on that day, and we will go all the way down to 20% of the comp competition left. Then, later, on October 12th is Columbus Day, and also Indigenous Day, but for this day, we're going to be live streaming this We'll be live streaming on our channel for five hours. The game depends on my decision. On October 16th, 2020 is the final round of Tournament 3 as the three finalists that make it there will compete to win the entire tournament. And your grand prize is if you win, you will automatically be number one for the entire tournament and number two you'll get me as a subscriber and number three you're moving on to super tournament one which is um sometime in 2022 which is about a little bit less than two years now Alrighty. oh i forgot to make that bigger but on october 26 2020 a new tournament begins tournament four round one there will be 40 players. I'll have more information later throughout the video during the draft. As if you're interested in that, you can check that out at the end, later in the video. But first, I want to go over everything else. Next up on the list, and the last special event, is on October 31st, 2020. And that is going to be another five-hour live stream, but this time for Halloween. As it's something you can watch, because trick-or-treating is probably canceled where you live right now. Well, not canceled, it's just not recommended. Alrighty, one more thing. We're gonna go go over the basic schedule and channel version 6.4 before we go to the draft. So I'll see you guys there. Welcome to the Season X, everyone. I'm saying this again, it is 
time to go over to Common Schedule, also known as Channel Version 6.4.0. Now, you may have noticed the second digit has changed instead of the third. That's because games have been removed and special events have been added weekly. You'll see what I mean when I go over to Schedule. Mondays, we will be playing Minecraft. Minecraft, I didn't know they were going to make it in this month. Because if you, because Minecraft came in fourth in the September Battle of the Games, so it will be in this schedule. What is the Battle of the Games, you may ask? Well, last month, depending on those, you, you remember all those 100 subscriber special videos? There was six games on that list. The top four of those games I decided to pick to be part of the October schedule. Now, I'm doing it again this month for the live streams that are going to be happening on the month, except for the holiday streams. Except only the top two will be able to move it on into season Y. Alrighty. Tuesdays is Fun Run 3. As you may expect, running as little furry little creatures are going to be back in action and killing each other for the next whole entire month. As because Fun Run 3 came in third place in the September Battle of the Game, so that is why it's here today. As this will be on Tuesdays. Wednesdays. Not including yesterday. Because, well, it was season 9 yesterday. Brawlhalla came in second in the b Battle of the Games, so therefore, you can continue seeing me kick people in the face, hit people with axes, or even punch them out the arena with my gauntlets. As it's coming back for another season, so just enjoy this showdown when it comes. Thursdays is of course Genometry Dash, as it as always. Oh, I forgot to change the Fun Run 3 thing on the um, thing because I copy pasted it, so I didn't have to write it over and over again. But Genometry Dash came in first in the September Battle of the Games, so it is also included on this schedule. Oh, but it's on Thursdays, which is literally one day before Fridays. Speaking of Fridays, on Fridays is a one-hour live stream. Get ready for this event because each week will feature a different game. Now, whatever game it is, who will know until it happens? Alrighty, Saturday's two-hour live streams are twice as long, and will also feature a different game every week. Keep in mind, one-hour live streams and two-hour live streams will not, may or may not receive the same game during a single week. And then on Sundays, maybe a big surprise, but... Sunday's SRK, aka Super Roblox Cart, is coming back. So get your carts ready because we are going back. Super Roblox Cart is back and ready for more, so get your engines ready as I get ready to beat some more people. Every Sunday. Because I decided to remove the um, podcast because it wasn't doing very well. So this is what's going to be here for the rest of the year. Very exciting, right? Well, should be. Alrighty. That's... That's it. Unless if you want to see the tournament for draft, then you might as well leave now. But, if you want to see who gets drafted into tournament for, continue watching, because that's gonna happen. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the tournament for draft, and today we're going over the 16th round pick. Now, keep in mind, the tournament, begin tournament four begins on October 26th, 2020, during um, season X, which is now this season, so be ready. And it will end on February 3rd, 2021, also known as Chapter 2021 Season 2, which is several seasons away still, because obviously it's at least 100 days. Really, if you think, it's about 130 days, actually. Now, today's draft pick comes from the Music District, so if you love music, you'll love this channel. I hope you do. Today's draft round pick is Moof Miser. Congratulations, you are the 16th round pick in the tournament for draft. Now keep in mind, there are 24 spots remaining 
on the tournament for draft, which is another 24 days until we are done with the draft. Now get ready, because here are going to be the rules. There are 1,000 subs or less, 40 competitors, 16 draft districts, 10 rounds, 4 eliminated per round, 3 eliminated on the final round, and 1 winner. And if you haven't noticed from yesterday, one of the districts is full. There are still 15 other districts, as no other district has became full today. But another thing, contestants cannot vote during out throughout this entire draft. No, throughout the entire tournament, I mean. There's no voting when it comes to the draft. It's all up to me. Alrighty, and that's that. Good luck, and here are the other districts. The Ultra District. The Auto and Vehicles District. Comedy District. Education District. Did I miss one? Entertainment District. Gaming District. How to and Style. News and Politics. Nonprofits and activism, people and blogs, pets and animals, science and technology, sports, and travel and events. And now for the district that has been became full is the film and animation district, and this has become a rivalry between Heidi's drone shots and the Thomas Lab, as these two are both rivals as of now on because they are both from the same district. So if you check out both of these channels, which one do you think will win the rival team? Let me know in the comments below. And that's pretty much it. I will see you guys tomorrow for the next video. Tomorrow is Friday, which means we're live streaming for the first time in season X which is coming very early. And I will see you guys there.